Hello YouTube and welcome to part 2. Today we are continuing to work with JUnit and in today's video, which is going to be a pretty short video I think, we're going to talk about test suits and test primers. In previous video we have already created our test suit over here. So in today's video we're going to create one more and then we're going to combine them into a primer and we'll run them. But before we actually do that, let me show you how you can run this specific test suit that we have already created. So let's go to Java, right click on it and create a Java class. Let's call this one main because we are going to create a public static void main method in here. Pass in the args and then let's just spell this correctly. So now we can use um, JUnit core. We're going to call JUnit core and we're going to say run classes. And we're going to pass our test suit one as a class. And that's it. So let's see what happens when we run this. Okay, our test suit was executed. And now let's go ahead and create a second class. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy everything in here. And I'm going to go to my Java. I'm going to create new class. I'm going to call it test suit 2. And in test suit 2, I'm going to paste everything from my test suit 1. And just to see that both test suits are getting executed, I'm going to select this and I'm going to add something like from, oops, actually misspelled from, so from test suit 2. And we're going to do the same thing for test suit 1. We're going to insert that in so we can see who is who from test suit 1. Okay, so now what we're going to do, we're going to create another class which is going to be our primer. So we're going to call it test primer. And this test primer is going to run with so we're going to use run with annotation to call the suit class and then we're going to say suit and going to pass in suit classes as a collection and the suit classes that we're interested in are test suit 1 as a class and then test suit 2 also as a class. So now that we have our primer which is, consists of two different test suits because remember here we have multiple tests so this is a test suit and this is a test suit. So now we need to execute the primer to execute this two test suits. How we can do that? Well we just change in our main method, we change the class that we passed in to JUnit Core to test primer. And now when we execute this, both classes will be executed. And you see the first one to be executed is test suit one, and then after that we execute the test suit two. So pretty short video. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and in the next video we're going to talk about retry logic, how you can rerun your test if it failed, and yeah, it's going to be fun. Thank you guys for watching. Take care.